go. All right, what I got here is the uh, mm -hmm. U.S. Army uh, Carver One um, paintball gun here. I just got it, so I'm just gonna do a quick unboxing of it. Right here, we have your original this barrel sack here. Uh, right here, it's black and yellow. Right here is the um, uh, eight and a half inch barrel. Well, you wanna lube this up first before putting that in the gun. Right here is kind of a cheapo thing they use to clean your gun. But I suggest a squeegee. A squeegee, whatever. I uh, suggest getting a new one because it's pretty crappy. I've used it before. Right here is uh, Carver 1 um, US Army uh, paper gun here. I've used it before, but I, I really like it. It has different firing modes. Uh, right here, you can see right there, you put a Allen wrench or a stick in there, and it will turn on the green light flasher. Put an 8 volt battery in here, unscrews right here. And you know if it's working because it's like this, you pull this back. Oh, I didn't even turn it on, but whatever. You get the point. When it, when it's turned on, this will. When you pull it back, this will spring forward. You could keep pressing it and it'll go like boom, 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 boom. We had problems with that. Yeah, we, that's what. It's because in the manual right here, it says nothing about it. Like we read the whole manual. This, yeah, we read the whole up. manual. It, it there's nothing about it. Like absolutely nothing about it. So I looked online. It's right here. It explains everything. I looked online right here about the batteries and stuff like that. It took us and like three hours. Right here is your just original uh, hopper. Uh, hopper uh, attachment, attachment type here. thingy. We attach it right here. Uh, quickly, just tighten this like this. I hope you know I don't have a steady hand. All right. Well, it's right there. You <laughs> tighten it. It's all good. Now, just quickly once you lube it up, I already did. <laughs> yep. <laughs> you put it right in here. Tighten it down. Remember, righty, tighty, lefty, loosey. I figured that out. Not always, not if you're holding it backwards. <sighs> Whatever. Alright, so let's go in here. I suggest getting a foregrip. Like, it's supposed to come with a foregrip, but the side that I got in it does not come with it. But there is a. You can get. There's a refund coupon in there where you send it into a company. Rebate. Rebate coupon. And. You, you can get the grip, it'll give you it for free if you send it into the company. And you should get it probably two or three where uh, business days. So this Monkey. is the this is the gun right here, Carver 1, US Army. Once again, this is where you put the battery in, because you can look that up, because it's really kind of confusing if it's your first gun paintball right here. And as well, we've got time. I suggest getting uh, this helmet. It's it's 30 bucks where I bought it. It's a thermal, so it's like two two plates of glass here. Or plastic, so uh, that you don't get like fogged up, like when you run and stuff like that. When you're camping or having a long game or something, your mask doesn't get fogged up. It's really nice. I've used it before. This is an attachment for it, but I don't suggest using it because it kind of blocks your view from the sides when you look over, like uh, bar across a the barrier or a bunker. So yeah. And the hoppers you can get probably anywhere. I got one for free. It's over in my closet over there. But that's yeah, pretty much a car with one paintball gun in I got a tank for it. I got a ninja tank. Mm -hmm. And a ninja tank for it. And it works pretty well. And I'll probably do a couple uh, shoot videos for it or fire testing. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed this. First, my first unboxing of a paintball gun. And thanks. Are you done, Mia? Yep.